Uh, what the hell is going on with this? What the crap? Bottom half of my screen is freaking out. Nope. Turning off DX3 did not help. What the hell is this? Alright. Well. Cue technical difficulties, everybody. Okay, so now that we fixed that little graphical issue, greetings peeps, my name is Fangly Fish. welcome back to SCP Containment Breach. Uh, as you can see, uh, over the past few episodes I've been experiencing some technical difficulties, and it resulted in us having to cut our last session a bit short. But anyways, we managed to make a lot of progress, and uh, we're going to try to continue. Get the SNAV out, okay. And, um, of course, as soon as I say that, it, it gives me four goddamn frames why do I have four frames per second? This is infuriating. What the fuck? <laughs> Why won't you let me play, you game? Why? Okay. No intro. We're just gonna find our... I... And, uh, there goes the frame right again. Okay. For some reason, um... I can now not use the S Navigator Ultimate because every time I try to bring that on screen, my frame rate crashes. Oh my goodness! Okay then. That was, uh, that was, uh, 173. And, um, we're gonna go, we're gonna go the other way. Yeah, other way seems like a good idea. Alright, so anyways, uh, last episode we went into the maintenance tunnels, which I'm not really sure why I did that. It was seemed like a pretty bad idea at the time. Hello? It's the mask. The Keter mask. Uh, I'm gonna close the door behind me. Don't want any interruptions. Oh, uh, boy. Okay. I know one of these is like the containment chamber for the dude. Alright, that's gonna be, that's gonna be where the mask is actually at. So this must be the observation room. Hey, buddy. What's up? Yeah, that's that looks totally not threatening at all. Someone actually found me. I thought I was dumb for a moment there. <laughs> I can get us both safely to the surface. Just find the control panel in there and open the chamber doors for me. I... I don't think I believe that. I think you're just bullshitting me. You're being possessed, dude. You've got a Keter class object on your face. I don't think you're entirely. I don't think you're going to be entirely reliable. Well, what are you waiting for? Um. All right, there's a keypad here. Huh. All right, I admit it. I wouldn't blame you if you don't think I look trustworthy. Uh, you think? Please, I need your help and quickly. The mask has been stuck to my face for some time now, and I think I might need medical attention, or it might kill me from the inside. <coughs> Just let me out, and I can find us an exit in a matter of time. Alright, look. If you still don't think I'm trustworthy enough, there's a locked storage room behind you. You probably noticed that it's guarded with a four-digit passcode. Inside is some useful equipment, as well as a pill of SCP-500. The passcode is 5731. There we go, now we're talking, see? The freaking. There we go, see? You're- Now you're doing me favors, okay? So now I can, uh, maybe do you a favor, okay. Let me see. Experience strong- When SCP-035 is placed on the face of an individual, an alternate brainwave pattern from SCP-035 overlaps that of the original host, effectively snuffing it out and causing brain death in the subject. Subject then claims to be the consciousness contained within SCP-035. Psychological analysis has discovered SCP-035 to possess a highly manipulative nature capable of forcing sudden and profound changes to the individual's psychological state. Has proven to be highly sadistic, prompting some to commit suicide, so, uh... Yeah, I'm going to take the advice of the uh, postcard, and I'm not going to let you out. I think um, I'm just going to let you rot in there. So, um, yeah, goodbye. See you later, buddy. Thanks for the shit. I will be leaving now. Okay, that's the... Uh... 
Alright, this is the bell, and um... <coughs> Alright, so basically, once you ring the bell, you start experiencing weird hallucinations and stuff. And um... <sighs> I... I really... Really... Do not... Want... To do this. But... For the sake... Of the entertainment of my viewers... I'm gonna ring the bell. If I can figure out how to ring the bell. Okay, it's not gonna let me ring the bell. And, um, you know what? I'm not going to... I'm not going to... There, I gave it my best shot. I tried to ring the bell. The game would not let me. You cannot say that I did not try to ring the bell. You'd be lying. Okay. Yeah, okay, for some reason... Yeah, okay. Alright, so basically the S navigator is now completely useless, because every time I try to take it out, my frame rate goes to shit. Wandering around. Okay. You know what? I actually think I read that... I'm not going to actually go down to the containment chamber, because that summons 106, but I read that... If you get into the control room... Why... Why'd everything go black? Memory access viol- <laughs> Error memory access violation. <laughs> okay, so I really did not want to have to do this, but... Never mind! This is some freaking... This is some freaking bull to the shit going on right here. Let me... Okay, apparently I cannot go in that chamber, because every time I do, the game crashes on me. Well, that's just lovely. <sighs> Some goddamn motherfucking baloney. Okay, which way did I come from? For some reason, the game's being extremely finicky right now. I don't know why, the first time, a couple times I played it, it worked just fine, and now it's suddenly decided it's gonna give me issues. Hello, Mr. Duck, how are you today? Alright. Anomalous Duck. By the way, I highly recommend- oh. Wait. I feel like I've gone in a circle because... It'd be so much helpful, so much more helpful if I could use my S-Nav. Okay, yeah, I am, actually am going in a circle. Alright. Get rid of that. Okay, so. So yeah, I just went around in a big circle. I'm just trying to get my bearings. I, thought, actually, I haven't actually ran into an SCP-173 that many times. It's mostly just opening a door, seeing him, then immediately closing the door, and going the other way. It hasn't really been all that th much of a threat. Oh, it's the bear. What's up, bear? Are you gonna freaking make tiny other bears out of fetuses and ears? Entrance zone. Alright, so we're already at the entrance zone. Which, um... Uh... The fuck? That's, um... I fell out of the map! I give up. SCP Containment Bridge, you fucking win. I think this map seed might be screwed, or some reason my game, installation of the game is messed up. I don't know, but I'm going to try reinstalling the game. I'm gonna see if that fixes any of the bugs. I might end up starting an all-new save as well. Because this is just infuriating. I can't deal with this crap right now. My name is Fangly Fish. Hopefully there will be more SCP Containment Breach in the future. Goodbye. <laughs>